Hello there, happy Sunday and welcome to Craft with Fee. I'm Fee and I am running a 10 week uh, Tilda Lovers Club Windy Days Stitch Along. So if you don't know what that is, it's um, 10 projects in 10 weeks. Every Sunday I produce a new project using some of the Windy Days fabrics. The fabrics behind me there you can see are the ones that we used in this in, in this week's project. Um, so you can uh, just buy a digital download template pack if you want to use our templates or you can just make the projects in your own way each week. If you bought a Tilda Lovers um, stitch along accessory pack you have a lot of the accessories in there that you will need. And the other option is you can also buy a kit each week. Now the lovely Sandra at the House of Patchwork in New Zealand has some kits left if anyone over there is interested. Hers arrived a little bit later than we had hoped. Uh, the shortage of planes going from Australia to New Zealand has slowed up postage to New Zealand incredibly. But she has them now and she's just waiting on her Windy Days fabric to arrive which shouldn't be too far away. So if you're in New Zealand just contact Sandra at the House of Patchwork and she'll be able to help you out. The accessory kits here in Australia have sold out so um, but as mentioned we will have little uh, you know kits each week on offer. Not a lot but just a few. Um, so this has been a six month process. I'm not sure if any of you really realise um, how much goes into a stitch along. There's a lot of planning. Obviously to produce a stitch along accessory kit you have to know what you're making a long way out so that you can order the products in uh, and then also put them together and, and make sure that you've got everything that you need. So um, to me these projects um, have been around quite a while but to you they're going to be new for, for me. Uh, but before I reveal this week's project I just wanted to run through a couple of things with you. Uh, the Tilda Lovers Mystery Box number four has gone out. Um, this is it here. If you don't know what the uh, mystery box is, is it's a beautiful box full of four little mini kits and also two gifts. Um, and it comes out every month. You can subscribe. It's $50 to, su to subscribe each month. Or if you just want to buy a box as a one-off, they're $57.95. And we do have a few of the fours left on the website. I think we've got a couple of threes left as well. One and two are completely sold out. Um, but I'll show you the projects that came in number three just to give you a little bit of an idea of this the you know the type of projects and then I'm going to give you a sneak peek of one of the projects in box four so if you have subscribed to box four and you don't want to see uh, that project well then I will give you a bit of a warning prior but let me show you the projects that came in box three so we had a tool bag which has got some stitchery, that little stitchery comes pre-printed. You get the um, fabrics to make the hexagons, the bag, um, and it's ideal, it holds a rotary cutter. It'll also hold all your pens and pencils and all that sort of thing as well. So it's great to take to class or to retreat or whatever you want, or even just to keep them in the one spot um, in your sewing basket. But uh, it's a little tool bag. So everything was in that pack to make that. So, and then you've got the pattern if you want to make more so it's not just a, a single use pattern you can you can continue to make more if you want then we had this little wall hanging so it's got some stitchery and uh, applique you get the hoop you get everything you need um, to make this including the threads and uh, it's very very cute so that was project number two project number three was this gorgeous little Christmas ornament so it comes with a pre-printed stitchery for you to do, the threads and everything there. So that's very, very cute. And then project number four was this little purse. So it's a flex frame purse. It's got some beautiful Tilda Chambray, um, a lovely little stitchery, and also the, um, the gorgeous Tilda Roses fabric, I think this one was from memory. So um, yeah, everything is there. So you, you get to make that as well. Um, so, as I mentioned, they aren't just single use, you can use them time and time again. Now, one of the projects in Tilda Box number four, I'll show you, is this one here. It's a gorgeous little purse. Isn't it beautiful? So, lots of little yo yo's on that one. And yeah, I'm not going to show you the others, but anyway, um, that's what the Tilda Lovers Mystery Box is all about. Okay, one other thing before we get on to this week's project is I'm running a card class for beginners. If you are interested, if you like paper crafts or you think you might like paper crafts, um, we're doing a card class. You get everything that you need except the stamps. If you, use, you need to use your own sentiment stamps to make these six cards. So they are beautiful and uh, pastel. Everyone knows I love pastels. Look at that one. Look at those gorgeous baubles this one 
So the cost of the class is $25 and you'll find it over on my craftwithfeestore.com. That's how you can, and this one here is a fancy fold card. That's how you can register. So um, that is the card class. Now that closes on the 1st of November and then they're sent uh, out shortly after that. You will not only get a PDF instructional sheet with that, you'll also get a private video to make all six cards. Okay, so what is the project this week? It is a table runner and I had to laugh. <laughs> I saw a table runner on in the Tilda group yesterday made by the lovely Anita and oh gosh, it's similar to mine. But anyway, great minds think alike, so I say. But mine is a little bit smaller by the looks of it. So this is what we have made. So this is a table runner. It's just a little table runner. Um, it measures... 10 and a half inches by 24 and a half, I think, from memory. So you've got the little stitchery, so you remember that I put those in the group. Uh, all the instructions for that are in the group, but they're also in the description box of the video, which is a separate video to this one. Um, you need to do two of those. You've got 18 little two and a half inch squares here in the center. Then you've got your borders, and then I'll show you how to do machine binding. So a beautiful little project. I absolutely adore it. Um, it's going to live on my buffet uh, underneath my window. One of the photographs that I've taken uh, that I've popped in the group is on that that particular buffet and that's where it's going to live. I absolutely love it. Now we do have, as I mentioned, we do have kits available for those people who like written patterns. This is a written pattern. As much as I hate writing them, I'm getting much more used to doing it seeing I'm doing the Tilda Club every month. Um, so this is a complete written pattern. You've got the pattern in there if you want to make more. There is also the pre-printed stitcheries for your first original one and all the fabrics to make the table runner top. It does not include the backing or the wadding. Um, you'll need to source those from your own stash. Now the cost of the kit is $22.50 uh, and there's the measurements on there. Yes, I've got it right. 10 and a half inches by 24 and a half. So yeah, you've got everything in there you need for $22.50. Uh, the other option is that you can download all the templates in a digital download, but everything is on the website. I'll pop a link in the description box. It's fifiandme.com. Uh, and so that's it for this week. So what we will be doing is anyone who um, who actually makes the table runner, please put a photograph in the Tilda Lovers group on Facebook and all of those people will go into a drawer and we'll draw out two winners every week for a little prize pack, compliments of Tilda Australia. Anyway, that's it from me. Have a wonderful Sunday. I hope that you enjoy the project. Please give me some feedback. I'd love to know what you think of it. Catch you next week. Bye.